Nebraska lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Around the 21 yard line. He just never had a chance to get any running room. The defense was on him almost as soon as the ball was snapped. Second and 14. Ball on the 21. Four down, four down. Mike 15. Mike 15. And down he goes at the 20 yard line. That is a loss of one yard. That makes it third and 15. Knocked out of bounds around the 28-yard line. Nothing the offense dialed up was enough to get by these guys. They're on right now. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. The Cornhuskers offense basically predicated on what this kid can do. The thing about, I love about this guy, Brad, is, is just the intangibles that he brings to the table. We've been seeing this guy make plays over the weeks, but the thing that I really recognize is his ability to really lead this football team. When things are going well, he's patting everybody on the back. When things are not going well, he's trying to pick them back up and getting them ready to go. So not only does he physically have the tools, but also I really love the way he approaches the game. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Hey, check Mike 39. Check Mike 39. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. away and it's a booming punt and down he goes at the 22 yard line every drive is important in a tie game I look for both sides to come out with some urgency he's gonna try and scramble He's taken down at the 40. A good quarterback knows when and how to improvise. And if he's got the skills, he can also turn a scramble into something big. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40. The ball is loose. It's picked up by the defense. Down around the 34 yard line. Good hustle there by the D lineman. It's often an overused term when referring to defensive linemen, but that's what they mean when they talk about a guy has a motor that's running. He never quit and he played to the whistle. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Check three, check three, check three. Hey, check my 39. Quick pass. And he's tackled around the 32-yard line. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 32. He's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. Very good tackle in space. I'm telling you, quarterbacks who can run the ball are so hard to stop. You have to scheme around them, which takes the best coverages out of your defensive playbook. In the shotgun and five wideouts. Hey, 
Sometimes when you've got speed, that's all you need. It's the one thing you just can't defend. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. He makes it to the six-yard line. to get into the end zone. He's a pretty sure bet to get six when you're this close to the end zone. He makes the PAT. A nice five-play, 34-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. Boy, this offense right now is just being physical, really controlling the line of scrimmage, and it's opening up some nice big lanes for the running backs. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Nebraska is looking awfully impressive right now in defense, but we are in the first quarter. Yeah, this is about a dominant first quarter that we have seen in a long time. But let's see if they can continue to play this well throughout the rest of the ballgame. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. And they make the stop at the 36. That's not everyday speed you're talking about with this guy. This is a unique burst combined with a really impressive field vision. From their own 36-yard line. First down. He's tackled at the 48-yard line. Gets rid of this one. Great job by the defense at getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. From their own 48-yard line. Second down. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Tackle made at the 38. the 33 from the 33 yard line it's second down two yard pickup it's a nice catch by the junior wide receiver but an even better effort by the defense to keep him from going anywhere Fights forward to about the 29. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. Now he's scrambling. Missed tackle, sacked, and they'll turn it over. And they lose possession on down. You know, that was one of those situations where you have to go for it to try to get something going. Now they need a big play here from their defense. Really a great stop by the defense. This will go down as one of those critical plays. These guys came up with a touchdown on their last drive, and they'll be hoping for another six on the board here. Nebraska is up seven. He's to the 40. They'll bring him down at the 44. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 44. After one, this game's still pretty close. 7 0, Nebraska. And we're back for more action here in quarter number two. Hey, check Mike 39. Check Mike 39. Go! Alert, alert, Steamer, Steamer! Play fake, looking to run. About nine yards there on the quarterback scramble.
Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Taken down right around the 30. Super effort by the tailback to pick up a nice gain in a first down. He's really a good looking ball carrier. Hey, right, hey, right. Four down, four down. Hey, check Mike 39. Check Mike 39. Three down. 288. They'll get him for a loss. Boy, did you see how the defense just swarmed to the ball carrier? That was fantastic pursuit. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Quarterback picked up a yard at best there on the scramble. Defense. He's got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. Quick throw. Nice throw to hit the out route against man coverage for a first down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 19-yard line. Nebraska up seven points. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. A nice seven-yard gain on the option keeper. And this play is number eight on the drive. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. They're about four yards away here on third down. Scrambled. Tackle right around the six yard line. That's the second time that this defense has given up a first down on third down. You that work so hard as a defense to get an offense to third down. When you get them there, you've got to be able to have somebody step up and make a big play. Whether it's a defensive tackle slipping through a block, a linebacker. Touchdown, Cornhuskers. Gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. This young man is no stranger to the end zone. That's two rushing scores for him on the day, and you have to love the way he's been running the ball all game. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. No matter how much people want to talk about points and offense, I still think that the best offense is a great defense. When you put a zero up there, it makes it pretty easy on your own offense to go out there and win the game. You think about the challenges these two teams are facing. On one side, you've got to find a way to keep building on your lead. And on the other side, you've got to find a way to get back in it. And down he goes, right around the 40. It's always a snap decision when you decide to tuck it and run. On that play, it was definitely the right move as he got the first down after a nice game. First and 10, ball on their own 40. Fires it out. He goes out of bounds at the 48. That's good for a game of eight yards. That'll bring our second and three. Tight left, tight left. Four down, four down. Hey, look, we're going to go Mike 15, guys. Mike 15, all right? Run, 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 run. He's got the corner. Runs right for a nice game. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Drilled the 38-yard line. 
very solid gain through the air. I'm impressed with the poise of this quarterback and the ability of the receiver to keep his concentration and get his hands on the football. a very impressive open field tackle from the 34 yard line it's first down play of the series. Slings it. Excellent open field tackle. Makes the catch, but just not enough for the first. Yeah, they're going to come up a little bit short here. Nice job by the defense of preventing this completion from turning into a first down. They're going to try a long field goal here. Gets it up and it's long enough, and he nails the long field goal. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Nebraska has put themselves in a great position now as they head into the second half. Well, in the first half, we saw a lot of big playability and just a lot of just an explosive approach by this offense. But remember, we'll see what happens here in the second half. This is a long way from being over. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. Nothing tentative on that run at all. He looked very determined and got the first down. First and ten. Ball on their own 36. Throws complete. He's got space to work. Good open field tackle. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. Intercepted. It's the sophomore corner. Brad, not only a huge interception to get the football back and maybe have a chance to get back into this game, but this could really change momentum. You can see the players and how they're responding down there on the sideline about how excited they are to get the football back and have a chance to put points on the board. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 33. One more play now before we hit halftime, so they'll most likely throw one towards the end zone here. He sails it long. And it's intercepted by the senior cornerback. And he tackles him hard at the 12. So we've played two quarters. The Cornhuskers lead 14-3. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. The expectation coming into this game 
is that both offenses would do what they've pretty much done in the past. Come up with these big plays, explosive chunk plays. The defense has done a great job being able to take them away. No, absolutely. And that's that's goal number one. And especially when you face an explosive offense, you know what they can do. And especially offenses like this, like you're talking about, when they hit the home run. You know, next thing you know, you look up, the guy's hitting his head on the goalpost, and he just went 70 plus yards. And you really want to try to limit the damage. And that's what you've done in the first half. You've made good tackles. Sometimes you got to make a difficult open field tackle on a wide receiver that is fast, that knows how to get to the end zone. But, you know, they've done enough of that in the first half to limit the damage and not give up too many big plays. Just about time to get you back out for the second half. Brad and Kirk will be along in just a second. You're looking forward to keeping an eye on everything around the country. Here, got a good, well, a good game score. We're locked and loaded. We got all the big screens going. You're gonna be looking to hand out some helmet stickers later. Yeah, we loaded, man. I'll try. You think you can keep on your shoes in the second half? I'll try to. Are they stinky? <laughs> yes. Brad and Kirk, you're at a safe distance. Take it away. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You think about film study coming up this week, they're not going to watch this. This has been sloppy football all the way around. Both teams turning it over. And here we go with the offense ready to get things going again. Pick up of a yard for the tailback. Boy, the senior linebacker's experience really showed on that run. He sniffed it out perfectly and made the tackle. From their own 26-yard line, second down. And he just gets rid of it. is out to the tailback on the screen. He's pushed out of bounds around the 30-yard line. Oh, excellent punt. And he's taken down at the 34-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Throws to the tailback, incomplete. Pretty good effort here by the quarterback in trying to squeeze that ball into a tight spot. I know it was incomplete, but he didn't have too many other options. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 34. Steps out at the 37 yard line. Call the game three yards. Third down. Got a man, watch out here. And he's tackled at the 41 yard line. That's a game of four. That brings us over to three. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Their last drive resulted in a punt, so let's see if they can put together something a little more promising here. Halfback screen, incomplete. From their own 20-yard line. It's second down. He gets rid of this one. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. And they make the stop at about the 39-yard line. That's good for a gain of 19 yards. 
First down. First down. From their own 39 yard line. First down. Tries to get around the corner. He's at midfield. He's taken down at the 38. That's a D23 on the ball. First down. Defense goes with the extra defensive backs as the offense comes up five wide. Laterals back. Brought down to the open field. It's second down, eight to go. Ball on the 36-yard line. Catches it and hit immediately for a loss. Five-yard loss on the play. This defense is fast enough that they can create negative yards on completed passes. So the offense might want to consider that next time they try that play. And once again, they'll come to the line, try to convert on third down. And he hits him hard at the 48-yard line. But the defense is fired up, responding and reacting to that sack. Not only do they get the quarterback, but they hit him and hit him hard. I think that can really create some confidence for this defense. The next time this quarterback drops back to throw, you got to be thinking he's going to be a little bit gun shy and concerned about the pressure that these defense is putting on him. He really got a hold of that one. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. Their last drive ended in a punt, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. Down two possessions. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. He gets out to about the 22-yard line. The running back gets two on the carry. That makes it second and eight. It's second and eight. Ball of the 22. Four down, four down. Come on, 16. I'm coming, 16. You're mine. You're mine. Scrambling around. He's out to the 30. Tackle made around the 40 yard line. Fake, looking to run. And he's taken down at the 46. From the 46 yard line. First down. And he makes it out to about the 44 yard line. Call it a gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. Tries to scramble, but he's sacked. Called a loss of five yards on the play. Third down. Third down now, and they need to get it down to the 36. Four down, four down. Hey, look, we're going to go Mike 15, guys. Mike 15, all right? Got it, complete, he's out of bounds. Gain 
and nine. This is the eighth play of this drive. It's a great run, and he's brought down in the backfield. So with one quarter remaining, Nebraska leads it 14-3. Just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Here's play number 10 on the drive. And brought down. That is a loss of four yards. That makes it second and 14. Looking to dig themselves out of a little hole here after the sack. It's second and 14. to his receiver. Brought down around the 14-yard line. These short, effective passes are going to help the quarterback's confidence. So far this drive, the defense has been unable to stop them on third down. Mike 15. Mike 15. Ready. <laughs> Well, he tried to thread the needle with that pass. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor decision, throwing into coverage. Needs to look at his progression and find the second and third receiver. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. It's up, and it's good. They line up to kick this one away. He really got a hold of that kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. Nebraska up by eight. Makes it to the 34. That brings up second and one. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. to him before he could get back to the line. Nothing doing that time. Defender stayed home, the blocking wasn't there, and down he went. Nice third down yardage off the option, and more importantly, enough for a new set of downs. From their own 35-yard line, it's first down. Decent pickup. That's good for a gain of seven yards. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Hey, check Mike 39. Check Mike 39. At 225.
throws, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. Number 80 was the intended Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Just under two to go in the game. Carries the ball for a nice game. Well, that's a great job by this offense. The defense knew that the run was coming, and they still could not slow them down. Pick up a first down and allows them to continue to work this clock. He's at the 40. And down he goes at about the 35. That's another first down, Brad. And right now, you can just really feel and sense the rhythm that this offense is in. Their ability to pick up first downs is pushing this defense further and further down, back deep into their own territory. He makes his way to about the 22. The Boilermakers using their third and final timeout. From the 22-yard line, first down. Tries to get around the corner. Big play, and it's first and goal. Tenth play of the drive. Bring him down at the seven yard line. A yard, maybe two on the carry. With the safeties coming up, making plays near the line of scrimmage, that tells your offense they've got to start throwing the ball to keep them honest. Two times, two times. From the seven yard line, second down. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. Favorite play in football of your quarterback, take a knee. And this is the 12th play of the drive. The Cornhuskers coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player after the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. Well, that's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.